it was um it was hard as an actor for me because I was a fan of his and I like the subtlety that he has and that he gets out of his performers, but what it was required of me was to be, as you saw, a kind of infomercial actor, where every line I said, I had to gesture with my hands, and then my inflection had to be a little bit like this, and I felt like I was doing terrible acting for Alexander Payne like, the whole time. every take, like, too much? Too, too much, much right? I did, and thankfully it was Laura Dern, because she's great, and he knows her, and so we actually hung out the day, the night, the day before we filmed the scene, and we talked and had drinks, and we kind of came up with this random backstory, because theoretically, what you're seeing is what the adult, uh, the full-size people get to see as part of the pitch when they go to Leisureland. So we theoretically do this show eight, nine times a day. So then it was fun to play with her and say, "Well, how long have we been working here? And are we really friends? And are we really a couple? Or are we just actors?" So we none of that's in the movie. None of that was even written in the movie. We were just playing around, but. Uh, it's the stuff that makes you feel comfortable going into a scene the next day when you have and to And not it. just feel like you're doing shammy, sham wow acting. Yeah. Yeah. And sitting in your head going, why am I doing this? What do you want me to do? <laughs> Please hire me for another job where I don't have to just do this all the time. 